Street photography has been a hobby of mine for a couple of years now, but there's still many situations where I'm hesitant to point my camera at a complete stranger. I've tried out a few sneaky tactics in the past, such as the lightning shot. The I wasn't really taking a photo of you shot. And the I'm just casually holding my camera shot. But what is the best way to convince someone and make them comfortable enough to let you photograph them? Yes, yes, give me that power walk. The nude pictures, what, what, what's going on with that? How's the scandal going? The, are the lawyers, are you gonna win? Are you gonna win the case, please? I'm gonna make so much money as a paparazzi. How's the training going? Do you think you're gonna beat him? Do you think you're gonna like smash him right in the face? Starbucks lady, how was your Starbucks? Your, your last two fights haven't been so good though. How, how did your breakup with Elon go? With Elon Musk? We need people to know that like you're gonna beat him. No problem. Re Jordan Peterson, Jordan Peterson, I, lo I love the book. How, how's Bitcoin doing? Was his rocket just like not good enough? How, how does it feel that you've retired from football? But he's like a billionaire. Ladies, how, how are you liking Fashion Week? Let's get, let's, get, let's get a closer angle. There we go, yeah. How's the collections? The collections look great, amazing, wow. You own Bitcoin. How are the Facebook stocks going, Mark Zuckerberg? I love the new album. I love the new, do you think you're gonna get the Grammy this year? You don't own Bitcoin? I don't have. Twitter really wants a piece of that, piece of that social media, you know what I mean? What, what do you mean? I'm a paparazzi. You're not waiting to meet an investor for Bitcoin, like to do a deal? No, I waiting to do it. So the paparazzi, I was very surprised by how many people weren't that bothered that I was shoving a camera in their face and taking a hundred pictures. They couldn't help but laugh because of how stupid it was. There were some people who got kind of angry with me because I was being a bit creepy and a bit of a dick. I thought I would get shouted at constantly, people would walk away, people would swear at me. And that didn't really happen. I think there is something to the paparazzi, but on to the next method. Thank you so much. You guys look great. I should take pictures of you. Can you take a picture of me? Is it okay? Perfect, yeah. Give me, give me a little smile. Could you take a picture of me? Oh, perfect. Yeah, these are great. I should take pictures of you. You look great. Amazing. Yes. Would you be able to take a picture of me? Oh, amazing. You look cool as well. I should take pictures of you. You look amazing. Wow. Incredible. Can I see? Yes. Yes, please. I don't know. I hope so. Oh yeah, they're great. Great. I should take pictures of you. You two look amazing as well. Perfect. Yeah. These are great. Bye bye. Hi. Can you take a picture of me? Oh, thank you so much. Oh, these are great. You look so cool sat there on the bench. I should take pictures of you. Like you're like a model. So stupid. This is the stupidest one. Would you be able to take a picture of me really quickly? Oh, thank you so much. The trees and me, most importantly. You look so like stylish. I should take pictures of you as well. You look great. Incredible. Give me like the point. Give me a, give me a point. Yeah, that's it. Like a Bitcoin trader. Yeah, sure. Why not? Let's get creative. You guys are so fashionable. I should take pictures of you. Amazing. Give me a fashion model look. Vogue magazine, front cover, you too, definitely. Yeah, yeah, with the star, I love Starbucks. I mean, you, you did me a favor, so you know, like, it only, only makes sense if I should do you a favor. A few more seconds. Slightly canted angle, something a bit dynamic. So portrait mode. Perfect. We'll come around this way. Oh, um, well, I've scared away all of the people of Budapest. In ways, this is much more strange, creepy, and uncalibrated than the paparazzi. Because at least with the paparazzi, you're going in, you're telling someone what is happening. You're like, I'm a paparazzi, I'm gonna take pictures of you right now, and they have no, t no time to react, basically. You're just taking pictures, and it's so obvious that you're taking pictures. However, with this one, you're a nice, normal person, saying, please, can you do me a favor? Can you take a picture of me? And they say, yes. And then as soon as you get the picture and you're like, oh, I'm really happy with the shots, that's when the creepy, uncalibrated, 
person comes in and people just feel so strange because you were this normal person one second then you're this strange weirdo who doesn't understand how normal human interactions work. I wouldn't recommend this method. It was definitely the weirdest one so far that I've done. I'd rather do the paparazzi. I want to do the paparazzi, but we have a third method to do. Excuse me. Hello, hi. Uh, do you mind if I take a picture of you? I think it looks cool with like your shirt and the background. You have such a cool look. I was wondering if I could just take a photo of you, if that's okay. No, no. Okay, cool. No, bye-bye. You did have a cool look though. A, fo a photo? Have you? Yeah, no? Yeah. Is that okay? Yeah. Cool, thank you, man. Uh, if you just look into the lens for me. Yeah, we'll try one. Oh, that's bad. I'm hungry. Yeah. I'm <laughs> 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 Did you drink a lot? No, not that much. We came in last night. Not that much. Getting old, you know? So, uh, <laughs> 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 nice to meet you, Marco. Yeah, enjoy. Hopefully, you'll drink some water and have some food and you'll yeah. be okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Nice so meeting you, man. Have a good day. Oh, great. What's your name? Eddie. Eddie, cool. Yeah, yeah. Can you dance salsa? Ah, uh, no, but I can take good po photos. It looks yeah. kind of cool, like with the sun and your your style is cool. Yeah, sure, okay. sure, man. Cool, man. Oh shit! Oh yeah! Oh, oh, oh yeah! <laughs> You're really good at this. Of oh, cool, nice. guys. Thank you. Yeah, Did man. You say Pleasure. That Adam. Adam, yeah. Oh, okay. I was just wondering if I could take a picture of you. Take a big, and then like blow the smoke out. Are you on break from like working? I want to go home. <laughs> uh. So actually asking someone normally if you can take a picture of them. I thought it was going to be way more difficult because this time I'm actually giving them a reason to reject me. And as you can see by the interactions, it wasn't just me coming up with my camera and just taking a picture and just going. It was actually having proper conversations with these people, learning about who they are and why they were sat on this particular bench or why they were stood where they were. I think that's what the great thing about this method is that you can actually build a human connection with someone and figure out about someone's life. And it's surprising how open people are to you when you just start a conversation. So there's definitely something in each of these three methods. The paparazzi's no filter approach to just taking a picture of someone is something that you can incorporate into just seeing someone on the street in an interesting yeah, situation and taking a picture of them. Maybe not running up to them and pretending that they're a celebrity who's been involved in a scandal, but definitely the idea that people aren't gonna get mad. People are not gonna punch you in the face if you take a picture of them. People are not gonna scream at you and swear at you. I would say the second one was perhaps the one that made people the most uncomfortable in certain ways, in that I just turned from this normal person who wanted a favor from them, and then I took that favor away by just taking a picture without their permission. But the ultimate combination, it's a combination of all these three in a different way. It's a combination of assuming permission in certain circumstances and then asking when it feels appropriate and when it feels like you can work together with the person and get an incredibly amazing picture or a series of pictures that you wouldn't otherwise get if you did the other method. If you guys enjoy this video, hit the subscribe button. As a new YouTuber, that would really help me out a lot. And let me know what you thought about the three methods that I did. And also, if you guys actually try them for yourself, let me know how it went for you. Thank you guys for watching. I've been Adam Grasso. I still am Adam Grasso. And I shall see you in the next video.